The regular season is set to begin, and we're thrilled to bring you all the live action right here on 2K Sports. Moments away, it'll be the Philadelphia 76ers going up against the San Antonio Spurs. I'm Kevin Harlan, joined by Clark Kellogg and Mike Fratello on the sideline, David Aldridge. Nothing could be better. Did you ever get opening day jitters? Yeah, I did. I mean, the butterflies are there, and it's a good thing. The key for me was to breathe deeply, get that first sweat going, and then everything settled down from there. Now, here is Irving. Here's Malone. Good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. Making it look effortless. I like seeing Malone stay with his shot through the contact. Here's more, and the layup is good. Take it right to the defense. Not a bad way to start this game. Cheeks with it. Screen by Malone. Cheeks against Moore. Jones. Back to Cheeks. Just five on the clock. Malone with the screen. Releases from 15. And he comes up with the deuce. You better really bring it to stop Malone. He's a load. More up top. Defended by Cheeks. And Morks to Gerber. Here's Gilmore. Hits the jump hook. Defending him inside is never an easy job. A little reminder of that right there. Cheeks against Moore. 18 feet out. Up again. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. You know, part of what makes Malone such a good rebounder is his aggressiveness. I mean, and he also has a real nose for the ball. Out to the wing. Maurice Cheeks. First personal foul. First team foul. Pass to Gervin. To the middle. Shots good by Gilmore. Excellent job surveying the floor that time by Gervin. Recognized when his guys were open and got it to him. Cheeks outside. And there's the block. Just stops it cold and takes possession. It's Irvin on the wing. It's good. He makes his first shot of the game. There are very few players who can slow a score of his caliber down. Irving looking for an opening. He takes it in. Can't hit from in close. San Antonio leading. And they've been producing at a very high level. No question they're in a nice rhythm offensively. 18 feet out, and the jumper is good. An accomplished mid-range score. I like watching Irving get it done from there. For San Antonio, they've gone 4-5 or five from the field so far. Here's Gervin. Got it from 16 feet. I'll tell you what, he looks laser-focused out of the gate. Scary thought for the defense when he's locked in like that. And you worry about just how quickly he's working himself into a rhythm. Not what the D wants. Irving misses. And the D got super lucky he didn't drain that one. Cheeks against Moore. To the wing right side. Goes up the baseline. And yes, it's good. Not exactly the most solid screen you'll see. Still works, though. And we're just over three and a half minutes into the first quarter. Cheeks outside. Cheeks. 
Shot clock at six. And stolen by Banks. Moore outside. Dishes to Gervin. Five on the clock over Irvin. Rebound by the 76ers. And even though that one didn't go down, that's really good shot selection. This is what the coaches are encouraging. Even when these type of shots don't fall. San Antonio foul. Fred Rogers. First personal foul. First team foul. Irving up top. And that one's good. His second basket of four, shooting 50%. So much of Irving's game is motion. But he can also simply catch and fire. Irvin in the post. He's covered by Irving. Now Gervin. Clock at six. Over Irving. Shot by Gervin, no good. 76ers trailing. Jones, the pass to Ivoroni. Left block shot on the way. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. The Spurs have gone 6 of 9, shooting it well. Moore outside. Pass to Gervin. All alone. And that one drops. Six points for George Gervin. Elite vision from Moore. Always keeps his head on a swivel. Left side, Irving. And oh, the block shot grabs it out of the air. Moore against Cheeks. And Moore it's to Gerber. Back to Moore. Spurs working the ball around now. Gilmore, bucket number three. He's a perfect three for three to start. That's about as far out as you'll see Gilmore go. Cheeks outside. On the wing, Jones. Pass to Malone. Over Gilmore. And Malone gets it to go on the assist by Jones. Malone's got eight. This is where Malone feasts. Give him a rock down low, and he's looking to convert. Moore right side. Goes up at the stripe. Off the mark. His first miss of the game. One for two. 76ers have gone 7 of 12 from the field here in the first quarter. Now, here's Chiefs. No scoring in this one. The pass to Malone. Over Moore. Malone misses. The Spurs have gone 8 of 12 on field goal attempts so far. He's it up and in off the pretty assist. And the Spurs lead by four. Don't forget, Johnny Moore has led the league in assists. Cheeks outside. It's good from the top of the key. Six points for him. Right from the jump, these teams have been on fire offensively. It certainly made this an exciting early game. Bassers just keep falling. Now here's Banks. to Moore. Shoots over Cheeks. Moore with the bucket. Moore's got his second bucket of the game to go. Nice mechanics on Moore's jumper. He trusts himself to find the bottom of the bucket. Right side Irving. Over Gerben. Irving good. Even when you contest Irving's shot, he's capable of burning you. This is how gifted a scorer he is. There's the pick. Here's Gervin. Kicks it to Banks. Moore against Cheeks. Moore left side. San Antonio needs to get off a shot here. And there's the whistle on the shot. Took the foul. Shot misses. He'll be shooting two. Tough and lanky to deal with. Gerber draws contact easily. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Take a 
break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw, good, Gervin. There are so many incredible talents in the game today. But George Gervin, he might be at another level when it comes to scoring. He's off on the second. The 76ers trail by three. Here's Irving. And the 76ers tack on two more. And if you give him space like that in the mid-range, he won't hesitate to let it fly. Passes it to Roberts. Here's Edmondson. Here's Gervin. Nice four for seven for the four with that shot. This is where Gervin looks to score whenever he can. The mid-range area. To the inside, Richardson. Moves back up. And it's good on the way in. Love the balance here. Not just falling in love with the three ball. Inside and outside action. Moore against Edwards. It's Gervin on the wing. It's not going to go for him. And so Edwards will bring it up for the 76ers. They trail by one. Over more. Edwards can't hit. Well, that was an example of great defense. His teammates love that about him. Also why the shooters struggle against him. Gervin dishes to Roberts. Here's Gilmore. He's got six. Pass to Gervin. Here's Edmondson. Shots good by Gilmore. Gilmore's got eight points. At seven foot two, Gilmore can really own the interior and play above the defenders. We've got 148 left here in the opening quarter. It's tipped, and they'll keep possession. Edwards passes to Johnson. San Antonio foul call. And it's checked in for Philadelphia. And San Antonio with the change here, too. Paxson's checked in. Edwards passes to Johnson. Back to Edwards. Gervin against Richardson. Outside, Edwards. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Irving. He drills the elbow jumper. He's got 12. He is on some kind of roll. Julius Irving making it hot. Gervin up top. Richardson cover. Gervin passes to Paxson. It's Gervin on the wing. Richardson cover. Spurs working the ball around now. Offensive rebound. Gilmore. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. And the Spurs lead by three. Utilizing his size and agility there. Gilmore beats him to the boards and quickly gets a look of his own. Richardson left side. Gilmore grabs the miss. Richardson's gone one of three on the night. Driving to the basket. And the pass to Paxson. 27 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Edmondson passes to Gervin. And now the 76ers on the break. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. First personal foul. And that was a foul. No question about it. He deserved to go to the line after that hit. The 76ers shooting their first free throws of the game on this trip to the line. Shooting two. 
first one falls for him. And the Spurs making a change here. And Richardson drops them both. Paxson outside. Launches it. And no good on the last second attempt this time. A good close contest so far as we finish the first quarter. It's San Antonio leading by just one. And back in a moment as we'll get underway with quarter number two. Getting going again here in the second quarter. Fairly close game so far. And a moment now to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for San Antonio. The most consistent attack on offense so far has been the mid-range jump shot. We'll see if they can keep that rolling. They've also displayed a real unselfishness as a team. Moving the basketball well, sharing the rock, and giving everybody a chance to participate in the offense. Now, here's Richardson. George Gervin missing his last shot. Richardson kicks to Routens. The putback. It's good on the putback. And the 76ers lead by one. Putting in the effort to get a second chance look. Nice. Paxson passes to Brooks. Kervin up top. Richardson cover. And it's in there. George Kervin's got 11. A master of every type of shot. Kervin the teardrop. Just over one minute has passed here in the second quarter. Outside Edwards. And the foul on George Kervin. That is his first foul of the game. And Philadelphia making a change here. Stewart's checked in. Richardson outside. And it's Stewart, top of the key. Five to shoot. Pass to Richardson. Wants to get it to Malone and does. It's rebounded by Workman. San Antonio leading. Gervin passes to Paxson. Here's Workman. He's covered by Malone. It's Gervin on the wing. Here's Edmondson. Malone with the block. Now, this is blocking with authority. Malone putting some extra emphasis on the spot. Count it. Six points for him. A nice sense of when to move the ball and get the assist. Irvin surveying the D. The high post shot. He scores a six bucket from the floor with that one. He's shot the ball 11 times. So smooth, elusive, eel-like is George Gervin, especially when it comes to torturing defenses in screen and roll action. Now, here's Stewart. Back to Edwards. Here's Malone. That's in. That's his fifth field goal. He's shooting a hot 71%. Five for seven. Axon against Edwards. Ferguson, the pass to Gervin. It's hauled in by the 76ers. Malone's got his fifth rebound in this one. Edwards finds Johnson. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. And now it's a three-point Philadelphia lead. 
Excellent vision on display, dropping a dime to set up his teammate. Here's Edmondson. Hasn't made one yet. Passes it to Ferguson. That one, no good. Some solid defense from Johnson. They've been taking care of business, clearly. Especially at the offensive end where they've been totally in sync. Totally. Edwards against Paxson. He dishes it to Gervin. Hey, Mike, there's a lot of great young talent in the NBA today, but the veteran stars, I, I can tell, aren't ready to give up the spotlight just yet. Guys like Kareem, Dr. J, the Iceman, all the exciting players coming up right now, they've got a long way to go to match some of the achievements of those legends. And no one appreciates those legends, Mike, more than you, because I think you, having coached and played like you have, you, you know what these guys have put into their careers, into their individual games. It's mind-bending. They've set themselves up so that younger players can watch them try to emulate what they have done in the past and try to reach the levels that they have achieved, which may be very hard to do for a lot of them. Wow, you're exactly right. You know, that's what we call a good foul. Make them earn it at the line. It might not be pretty, but that's the right play in that situation. He saved the layup with that foul. Super two. the first one drops. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And San Antonio calls the first time out of the game. And they're starting off the season playing Philadelphia here. And last year's games were interesting to watch considering that each team came out with the win. And of course, they split their two meetings last week, So both sides are coming into this with a little extra something to prove. in for the 76ers. Spurs trail by nine. More outside. They need this. The shot is good. And so is his shooting tonight. Three for four. The 76ers have gone six of eight from the field in the second quarter. Now here's Richardson. Defense right on him. Count that one. 14 points for Moses Malone. So far Malone has it going on, folks. The defense appearing absolutely helpless trying to stop him. Moore passes to Banks. Spurs passing it around. Here's Edmondson. Good, and the assist goes to Kervin. Assist from George Kervin. The 76ers leading by seven. Cheeks with it. Still without a basket. Malone down low. Malone is doubled. 
And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. Veroni passes to Richardson. Clock is at three. From beyond the arc, and they force the shot clock violation. Great team. Some changes for Philadelphia. Jones comes in for Richardson, and Irving subbed in for Edwards. Moore outside. Here's Gervin. That will fall for his seven bucket, seven for 15 in this game. As talented a scorer as there is in the game today. George Gerber puts on a show every time he steps on the floor. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. You know, the way his shot went so wide, pretty obvious he got fouled. Oh yeah, plenty of contact there. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the 76ers. Everything working for them inside so far, guys. Tons of high-quality shots that they're knocking down inside. I also like how they've immediately gotten out in transition. They came to run. We'll see if they can keep it up. No good on that one. You know, Moses Malone is a true two-way player. He's an outstanding talent on both ends of the floor, able to score in dominating fashion, and really a ferocious rebounder. Good on the second free throw. And San Antonio has possession. Six-point game. That will conclude their brief two-game road trip. To the paint, Malone with the steal. They're running. Here's Irving. And then Irving slams it in. Good instincts from Malone on the defensive end. He manages to come up with the ball and gets the fast break ball right away. Spurs trail by eight. Moore outside. Here's Gilmore. And the Spurs scoring again. 76ers have gone 8 of 11 from the field in the second quarter. Really flowing here. Cheeks the pass to Jones. Inside. Here's Malone. It's deflected. So hard to get a shot past Artis Gilmore because he's big, he's deep, and he's got those long arms. Nice block there. Now here's Moore. Six points for him. Pass to Gilmore. Shoots over Malone. And misses it off the right side of the rim. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. And this is the attention Irving draws from defenses, forcing them to foul him. The 76ers have shot a good percentage from the free throw line so far. They've made five out of six. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That one is off. Such an exciting play to watch. Irving's athleticism, versatile offensive game continues to impress. No luck that time either. Spurs trail by eight. And stolen by Irving. the pass to Cheeks over Moore. Cheeks' shot is good. Cheeks has got his first two points. I love how decisive Cheeks is. Wasting no time getting his shot off there. San Antonio calls timeout. And so it's San Antonio with it, trailing by 10. 
And the officials will call the illegal screen right there. It's not that hard to spot an illegal screen. Most of the time, an easy call for the officials. And so it's Jones. He'll bring it up for Philadelphia. Ten-point lead. This is their biggest. Cheeks the pass to Malone. And that one is good. Malone's got 11 points in the quarter. So clever with the ball. Cheeks sees the floor and finds a way to set the guy up. Cheeks against Moore. Pass to Gilmore. Here's Edmondson. Again, the miss by the Spurs. Cheeks against Moore. Cheeks outside. Jones finds Malone. And easy two points on the layup. Malone's got the lead up to 14 now for Philadelphia. The story of their offense so far has been just that, getting a number of looks from point-blank range. To the middle, here's Edmondson. Basket good. Edmondson's got his second basket. He's got excellent vision on the floor, creating for his guy with a spot-on lead pass. Cheeks the pass to Ivoroni. Feeds to Irving. And the 76ers tack on two more. It's a thing of beauty to watch Irving shoot. His stroke is so silky. Here's Edmondson. Down low, here's Gilmore. Great pass to set up the lay-in. Gilmore's got 14 points. I like the play call. Very solid, making perfect use of the pick to get a great look. Jones up top. He feeds it to Irving. Floats one up. Rebound San Antonio. Banks with the ball. Guarded now by Irving. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. The Spurs have gone one for two on the night so far from the line. The line for the Spurs. Gene Banks. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That's good from Banks. Richardson, he's checked in for Malone. Gervin's checked in for San Antonio. And so he hits both. Now, here's Chiefs. Rebounded by Moore. Boy, he has to put that one away. A solid opportunity. Gone awry. Banks dishes to Roberts. Out to Gervin. Spurs passing it around. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Six to shoot. Moore passes to Banks. Here's the lob to the hoop. A flawless finish on the alley-oop. So good to see two guys on the same page like this. I know, it's like you and I, it's like they finish each other's sentences. Yeah, we know that feeling. Oh, we do. Or in this case, one finishing off the other's perfectly thrown pass. Moore with the bucket. Such poise down low. Moore is comfortable looking to score amongst the trees. Here's Irving. Connects on the foul line jumper. Irving's got 18 points. Nice job taking what the defenders give him. Those guys need a gut check right now. Yeah, you'd love to see a little more fire from the defense. They can't just be giving the game away. Roberts passes to Banks. And a wide open look for Gervin. No dice from the high post. Total breakdown from the defense there. I mean, he'll usually take advantage when that's the case. Richardson, no luck. Spurs trail by 12. It's deflected. Stolen by Cheeks. 
There's 42 seconds left in the second quarter. Here's Jones. Gilmore grabs the miss. Gilmore's got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. Hanks passes to Moore. Here's Gervin. And it's sent back by Irvin. Look out, Irving outworking the shooter and getting a hand on the shot. Moore against Cheeks. Passes to Richardson. It's his first trip to the line. At the line for two. And the first one at the line is good. The Spurs making a switch here. So after making the first, he goes one for two. Here's Edmondson. The dish now to Moore. Gervin outside. There's the feed to Banks. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. That's on Julius Irving. The Spurs have gone three of four at the free throw line tonight. At the line for two. The first one falls. So he gets them both. And so that's the end of the first half. 76ers lead by 11. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. A lopsided first half. We'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. An exceptional performance so far from Moses Malone. The way he's been working him in the paint has been outstanding. Just doing whatever he wants to down there. Yeah, he's been flexing on them, and they've offered little to no resistance in stopping him. They have to get more assertive and have to guard him much better. Wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Spurs trail by 11. And Morks to Gervin. Left side banks. Four on the clock. Moore inside, defended by Cheeks. No good from Moore. Moving against Banks. That's tipped. Moore with the steal. Into the lane. Out to Gervin. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. Oh, my goodness. That was not what this team needed. Well, that explains why they're down. Miscues. Philadelphia leading by 11. Cheeks outside. About one minute played here in the second half. Jones looking for an opening. Just two to shoot. It's good. Jones has got the opening bucket to start the second half for the 76ers. Spurs trail by 13. Moore outside. 
to the middle. Here's Roberts. That one drops for him. Out of halftime and right back to work. He says, you know my work. It's on display. Respect it. And I'm sure that was something they talked about during the break. Getting him some good looks in the paint right away. Here's Cheeks. After the basket by San Antonio. Here's Malone. The basket good off the assist from Cheeks. Cheeks has got six assists in the game. Moore outside. Gilmore passes to Gervin. To the inside. Marvelous lead pass, and he throws it down. Here's a guy who can light up the stat sheet. Impressive stuff by Gilmore. Cheeks outside. This is to Irving. Malone right side. And out of bounds as San Antonio gains possession. Second half of play with just under two and a half minutes gone. Moore outside. Here's Gilmore, guarded by Malone. The lead now cut to single digits. Gilmore's got 18 points. More than pulling his weight offensively. I mean, he's ready and willing to step up when called upon. And they'll need him to continue filling it up if they want to take control. Now here's Irving. He's got 18. And it's tonight. It's Gervin on the wing, defended by Cheeks. And Gervin kicks to Moore. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. Out of bounds, Philadelphia takes possession. You know, that's just sloppy basketball giving away a possession. No real reason for that turnover. And the replay demonstrating once again how aggressive that defense was. An emphatic rejection that was. Boy, you've got to appreciate that kind of forceful in-your-face defense. Here's Cheeks. Watch the move. Third quarter of basketball here in just a little under three and a half minutes gone by. On its way from Irving for two. Falls back and drains the fadeaway jumper. Irving's got 20. And when you're guarding him, you've got to fight over the top. Lock and trail around the screen and deny the perimeter shot. From seven, Malone with the block. To the paint. And no good. Looking for the alley-oop jam that time, but a communication breakdown broke it down. Yeah, that play just doesn't work if you aren't in sync with the recipient. He's been a dominant force on the glass for them in this one. Credit that to his physical play down low. Boxing guys out and winning those battles for the ball. Now, here's Cheeks. Here's Irving. He dishes it to Jones. And Jones comes it home. Yeah, you know, one thing about being a great scorer, you draw a lot of defensive attention. And there, Irving takes advantage by finding an open teammate. Here's Gervin. 15 points in the game. Inside and stolen by Malone. Irving attacking over Gervin. The shot's good from Irving. Irving's got four points in the quarter. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for the 76ers. Their defensive intensity has served them well. It's kept the offense scrambling and resulted in several steals. And the defense has been disruptive, forcing turnovers, challenging shots. The turnovers they've been able to turn into points, too. Cheeks the pass to Iberoni. Feeds it to Irving. Moore against Cheeks. Shot clock at five. Here's Jones. Jones. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And the 76ers lead by 15. I love the pursuit there he showed on tracking down that board. Yeah, fearless, wasn't he, Clark, on the glass? And it pays off for him. 
For sure. And the hunger that he plays with. You can't teach that. The screen's the key to that whole sequence. No way he's letting anybody power their way through. And he'll be shooting his first free throw of the game here. The 76ers making a switch here. Richardson's checked in. Find the lane. Find the lane. One shot. On the free throw, no good. One of the strongest guys in the league ever. Artis Gilmore is an intimidating rim protector. You don't want to drive to the bucket when he's waiting in the middle. That could be painful. And down it goes, jamming that one home. Hustle plays like that are crucial right now. You have to convert on every turnover you get. Cheeks outside. To Malone. They get a hand on it. Moore with the steal. Good on the shot, and that shaves the lead to single digits. Moore's got 10 points. If you allow him to get that close, you deserve to get scored on. Cheeks against Moore. The 11 footer. Sheik's no good. And so it's Gervin with it. He brings it up for the Spurs. Nine-point game. The pass to Gilmore. Makes it off the glass. Gilmore's got ten points now just in this quarter. Things really starting to click for them offensively, and they're mounting a nice run. Right back in the game, and if they continue scoring like this, they won't be trailing for long. Now, here's Richardson. Six points for him. One of the most difficult defensive assignments out there. Moses Malone, particularly inside. All right, well, look at how the points have been generated so far. The scoring breakdown for the Spurs. Taking advantage of what the defense is giving them, the mid-range. And they're happy to take it. As a former post-up player myself, you know I've got to talk about the work they're doing inside. I love what I'm seeing. The post presence has been a big part of this game. First one falls for him. And the Spurs making a change here. Free throws good for Malone. Spurs trail by nine. Pass to Gilmore. Here's Edmondson. Fade away. The shot's good. Edmondson's got six points. I guess they grew tired of playing from behind because they're working overtime on both ends right now. Renewed focus and energy can work wonders. Now they've got a nice little run going. Here's Ivoroni. Here's Irving. Another shot. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. He'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. A quality rebounder at his position. Irving positions himself well to collect rebounds. He's 0 of 2 at the line in this one. Julius Irving. Find the length. Find the length. One shot. That's good from Irving. The past few years, Clark, the dominant big man in the league has been Moses Malone. And he's coming off his second consecutive MVP season. Yeah, I think you're exactly right. And that says it all. Back-to-back -back MVP awards. Come on now. I think he's one of the toughest, most durable, intimidating, glass-eating centers to really ever play the game. That's how you score through contact. Terrific finish right there from Johnny Moore. And the 76ers decide to take their first time out here. It's 
John Paxson, he's checked in for the Spurs. Here's Cheeks. Mountains passes the Cheeks. Outside Irving. Five on the clock. Back to Cheeks. Here's Johnson. Banks with a rebound. Spurs trail by eight. More left side. Pass to Edmondson. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Irving up top, 25 points in the game. Richardson finds Johnson. Richardson against Paxson. From the baseline, Richardson, good. Richardson's got eight points. And uh, San Antonio shooting a smooth 58% from the field. Everything going according to plan for them on that end. Moore passes to Paxson. Here's Edmondson. Back to Moore. Pass to Paxson. Now here's Banks. Spurs passing it around. Launches a three. Here's Gilmore. And good work on the boards. They pick up the second chance points. Gilmore's got 12 points now in the quarter. Cheeks outside. Richardson right side. The basket good off the assist from Cheeks. And the 76ers lead by 10. And here are the Spurs. Moore up top, defended by Cheeks. 149 left to play in the third. It's good. Eight points for him. Philadelphia leading by eight. Cheeks outside. Outside Irving. Here's Johnson. There's another block. And he gets it back. He gets that one. One twenty-two left in the third. Cheeks against Moore. A putback controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Tremendous hustle working hard for that bucket. 76ers shooting percentage, 59%. The offense is running smoothly. It's Irving, top of the key. It's on target from the high post. Irving's got 27. And, you know, they aren't showing any signs of easing up. Their offense looks superb right now. They can't get careless with the league. And so far, this hasn't been the case. Now, here's Paxson. Nothing on the board. Here's Gilmore. And the layup is good after an ice lead pass. Great recognition there by Paxson. Noticing the open teammate and setting him up for the painless bucket. Irving up top. 27 points for him. Sinks that one from the post. Irving's got 11 here in this quarter alone. So good at getting to his spots and then cashing in, making the game look easy. And the pass to Banks. Here's Gilmore. He's guarded by Johnson. Here's Edmondson. Eight points for him. Rebound by the 76ers. Johnson's got his sixth rebound on the night. The 15-footer, and that one's good, Irving. And now it's a 12-point Philadelphia lead. And so it's the Philadelphia 76ers up by a dozen here at the end of the quarter. What a night they've had in terms of their shooting. Everything dropping in for them. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back.
And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same from the first three quarters. Edwards passes to Jones. And here's Malone. Back to Jones. Down to five on the shot clock. Shoots. Rebounded by Odom. Spurs trail by 12. With the drive. Yep, that one goes. It's been a shootout all night. Why let up now? I say keep it going. Why indeed. Keep going to the well and get buckets. Oh, here's Edwards. He feeds it to Malone. Got a hand on it. Fourth quarter of basketball. We're about a minute into it. And it's slammed in by Gervin. Explosive near the rack. Gervin levitating. Iceman going upstairs. Here's Richardson. Here's Malone. And it's Malone finishing it off. How about the effort on the offensive boards? Remarkable job, Clark. The coaching staff really appreciates that hard work. Love it. Not just the coaching staff, but his teammates do as well. Great work. And so it's San Antonio with it. 76ers getting the bucket. No good on the shot. Johnson with some nice D. Here's Jones. Shot goes down. Very quick possession right there. And now a 12-point Philadelphia lead. Paxson outside. Pass to Gilmore. Richardson with the double team. From about 16, he squares up and sinks it. Little things like that make a difference. Gilmore staying patient finds the open man. Philadelphia leading by 10. Richardson outside. Outside Edwards. Back to Richardson. High pose Johnson. To the paint. And there's Edwards on the assist by Johnson. Stay aggressive. I don't ever like to see teams pump the brakes when they've got the lead. Stay aggressive, attack. A fantastic way to pad your cushion. Absolutely. You know a run is coming. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. Sheets checked in for Philadelphia. San Antonio also making a switch. Roberts checked in. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thanks, guys. I was able to hear San Antonio's coach going over the plan during the break. Now, his tone was pretty serious. He said, you guys need to prove you're in this. No one else can do it for you. Time to pour on the gas. We'll see if that fire gets lit, guys. Thank you, David. Here's Roberts. Edmondson passes to Roberts. Nice ball movement by San Antonio. Here's Gervin. And he gets it to go. Gervin's got 19 points. He's slick. He's smooth. He's got a slithering nature to his game, which allows him to get busy in the lane. Now here's Richardson. Here's the teardrop. Chalk up two there. And the 76ers lead by 12. For San Antonio, they've gone an outstanding 4 of 5 from the field in the fourth quarter so far. Passes it to Gervin. Gervin double team. Wants to get it to Odom and does. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. Fighting to keep the play going. Grabbing the board and sending it right back. Shooting for San Antonio. Odom at the line for one. One shot. That one misses for Odom. 
The 76ers leading by 10. Cheeks outside. Here's Richardson. Boy, giving up the body to make a play right there. That's really good defense. He read that to a T. He got there early and braced himself for the hit. And the Spurs making a change here. Brooks checked in. Spurs trail by 10. It's Kervin on the wing. He gets it to fall. That makes it just a single-digit lead. Gervin's got six here in this quarter. And so Edwards will bring it up for the 76ers. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. To the middle, here's Malone. And then Malone with the dunk. A tried and true play for this team. Malone exceptional in the pick and roll. Jackson outside. Kervin double team. Here's Edmondson. He kicks it to Brooks. To the inside. Over Edwards. That one a little long. The 76ers leading by 10. Lost the Chiefs. And he makes good on the way up. Staying agile. The defense gets in close on Cheeks, but he slides by it. Spurs have gone six of nine on their field goal attempt since the start of the fourth quarter. Jackson passes to Brooks. Shoots over Johnson. Brooks misses. Philadelphia shooting a tremendous 61% from the floor. Hitting at all cylinders. And that one drops for him. And the 76ers lead by 14. For a 6-1 guard, Cheeks is never scared about bringing it inside. He believes in his game. Paxson passes to Roberts. Outside, Gervin. Here's the screen. And there's the pass to Edmondson. Back to Gervin. Six on the shot clock. For three, Paxson. That's in. Coming off the assist from Gervin. Gervin's got four assists in the game. Cheeks against Paxson. Oh no. And the bucket is good. Three point play chance here for him. The thing about Malone, if you don't wrap him up, he's going to score that. Personal foul. First team foul. At the line for one, Moses Malone. Find the lanes. Find the lanes. One shot. And that one misses. Spurs trail by 13. Banks inside. Malone on him. And it goes down two points. 23 points for George Gervin. Yeah, he's been hooping. But the rest of the team, not so much. Pass to Ivoroni. Floats one. And the layup is good. Great recognition to read the D and go with the floater. Beautiful touch. For San Antonio, they've gotten exactly two-thirds of their shots to find the bottom of the net here in the fourth, 8 of 12. They set the screen. Gervin double team. And Roberts to Gervin. The dish to Moore. Spurs passing it around. Gilmore, no good. Really good anticipation. Got a hand in the face right there. Really disruptive defensively. Great challenge. Spurs trail by 13. Gervin passes to Moore. Good, and the assist goes to Gervin. Teams love hammering the ball inside and getting easy looks. Cheeks outside. Outside Irving. Gilmore grabs the miss. Gilmore's got rebound number 15 here tonight. Banks dishes to Gervin. Back to Banks. Passes it to Moore. Gervin up top. Plenty of space. And it's Malone with the rebound. And then Malone with the jam. What a 
vicious slam from Malone, demonstrating how powerful he is down there. San Antonio calls timeout. Jones checked in for Richardson. Number 24. Spurs trail by 13. And here is more. There's the screen. Kicks it to Gerber. And count it from 19 feet away. And that's now 25 points for George Gervin. Not a quick release guy. Gervin does his best impression there. Malone passes to Ivoroni. Good, and the assist goes to Malone. And the 76ers lead by 13. It's Gervin on the wing. He's covered by Irving. Here's Banks. That one goes in. Fantastic anticipation with that feed. Philadelphia leading by 11. Down low. And the slam dunk by Irving. You love the vertical to bounce, the ability to go up. And then the power combined with that on the flush. Man, Irving making it look easier than it is. Now here's more. Out to Gervin. Gervin double team. Stolen by Cheeks. Driving in. And he converts the layup. Just slashing his way to the rim. Cheeks is relentless when he puts it on the deck. And so it's Gervin with it. He brings it up for the Spurs. Down by 15. To the middle. Here's Banks. Can't hit that one. Good work defensively by Jones. This is why you want the ball movement coach and player movement. And as a result of that, they've made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual player. Cheeks kicks to Jones. Pass to Cheeks. Clock at four. Over more. Ivoroni passes to Malone. And that one, good. Malone's got 35. As they keep expanding this lead, keep feeding him the ball. He's having a great shooting night, so yeah, I'd say getting him the rock is a great game plan. Here's Roberts. Here's Gilmore. Some solid defense by Malone. I love how he challenged the shot. That takes some guts to the hoop. Cheeks outside. From 12 feet out. Malone misses. Spurs trail by 17. Here's Gervin. Makes a fantastic move and nails the shot. Gervin's got 12 now in this quarter. Well, you see the playground mixology ability of Gervin. He can mix and match with the best of them when it comes to putting it in the basket. Outside Irving. Nice shot from the wing. Irving's got 17 points here in the second half. Hey, this was exactly the kind of game coach wanted to see from them. High effort, great play at both ends, gets the win for the Sixers. And they ran the fast break beautifully, I thought, Clark, all night long. And it was a huge part of their success. They ran the floor well, Kevin. They constantly put pressure on the defense and kept that pressure up. Tremendous effort. And it'll go down as their first official win of the new year. The one player that really stands out, of course, in this one, it was a dazzling game for Moses Malone. Boy, he was absolutely relentless at the offensive end, guys. Smelled blood and went for it. Well, their play has certainly gone to another level. You just wish they'd made this move sooner. But yeah, had this happened with more time left to go, they might have turned this around. That was an easy call on that shot. Refs will call that one 10 out of 10 times. At the line for Philadelphia, Maurice Cheeks. Shooting two. The 
first free throw is good. Motiques, you know, is as crafty a player as there is in the league. Makes good decisions with the ball just about all the time. And on defense, he can pick you apart. Cheeks hits them both. 52 seconds left in the fourth. Cheeks against Paxson. Edmondson passes to Brooks. Odom with a screen on Cheeks. There's the pass to Odom. Over Malone. The shot by Odom, no good. They are holding a comfortable lead here. you got to appreciate the game plan they put together for this one. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. And Johnson with the stop. Boy, the crowd had a huge role in the outcome in this one. It's tough to come into this building and beat them. Gervin against Edwards. Odin with a screen on Edwards. Here's Gervin. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. So it's the 76ers winning this one easily. Well, Clark, they put on a show for this home crowd, playing with a lot of precision and just having their way out there at the end. Yeah, this place was buzzing on fire. The energy was overwhelming, fun to watch, but not so much fun for their opponents. And that'll do it for the first game of the NBA season. For Mike Fratello, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, and our entire 2K crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. So long.